Uh, good morning. Um, I just wanted to do um, a quick video really. Uh, firstly, I want to apologise uh, for the fact that I've had to put my prices up. I really didn't want to have to do it uh, and I did try and uh, put it off quite a long time. But um, I, I, <laughs> This is my cat. Um, yeah, so I did try and put it off for quite some time. Uh, but unfortunately, I've lost um, two lines of income uh, recently and so I'm solely relying on um, this business now to uh, pay the bills and obviously bills are going up um, the cost of living is, is quite significantly higher um, so I've had to put it up and I'm trying to think of ways to um, supplement my income so I've um, done this lawn care course and uh, invested in a scarifier and an aerator so I can provide extra services um, to try and make some money there um, and a few of you have taken that up already, so thank you very much for that. Um, but obviously, I can only do four hours a day. Um, I, you know, I'm not uh, doing an office job where I can uh, earn an hourly income of eight hours a day or, or whatever. I, I just can't do that because of childcare. So um, I'm limited with how many hours a week I can do. I've started working on Saturdays as much as I can to try and get some more income. Um, but I need every penny I can get at the moment because, you know, finances are, are really hard for us at the moment. Um, so I've, I'm trying to think of other ways to make money, like I was saying. Um, and also, you know, if, if it's like heavy rain or one of the children are poorly or I'm poorly myself, I won't get paid. Or if I want to take a holiday or whatever, I don't get paid. So I've got to try and be business savvy now, unfortunately. Um, and things like if, if there's two of us working, I'm going to have to charge for both um, both of us to do that. Um, I, you know, and I do try and do my best for you. I, you know, there are times where I'll work home and I won't charge you for it or, you know, I'll get you free plants or free soil and rocks and whatever I can get you, I will. You know, I, I will go above and beyond to try and um, give you the best I can. And, I, you know, I've tried to not increase the prices too much so that it's unaffordable uh, and, I, and I appreciate that you know having a gardener can be a luxury thing for a lot of you that you know so I'm really grateful for those that have kept me going um, and if you've had to drop me because of the price increase then you know I completely understand and it's I'm not there's no sort of hard feelings or anything like that um, I understand that prices have gone up for it for all of you as well so you know something else with there the price is going up it, it it takes a hit and I, I really do appreciate that um but you know i have to take my prices up to uh, make up for losses i'm making as well um one of the ideas i've got uh, to try and make money is i'm going to because quite often when i'm out and about gardening stuff i like to take photographs of um wildlife or plants that i come across and i try and be a bit um, creative in the way I take the pictures and the, some of the pictures I really quite like um, I hope you agree and so what I'm planning to do is to make some prints um, using some of those images um, to sell so if you think that might be something that you're interested in please let me know so I know whether it's a worthwhile thing to do because obviously through the winter I get less work uh, when it's raining all that sort of thing so I need to try and make income while I'm working from home when I can't go out to gardens um, so uh, that's one way I'm, I'm going to try and, and make some income for myself. Um, I've got a family of five to feed, so um, uh, so I'm going to later on I'm going to put uh, the images of um, the the prints that I'm planning to sell on there, and I'm going to look into now what the prices of that's going to be, because obviously it's going to cost me to get the prints made, uh, and it'll cost me to post them to you uh, if I need to or whether it unless you're local of course um, so I'm going to look into that today um, but yeah let me know if that's something that would interest you um, and I'm always trying to think of ways to make more money just I'm not greedy I'm not um, you know some people I think have used this price rise situation to get greedy really and think oh I'll use this this as an excuse to put my prices up that's not what I'm doing at all I'm literally trying to feed my family and keep a roof over our heads um so yeah and, and also you know I'm trying to get people to work for me to try and get more income while I'm not you know 
what I can earn while I'm not having to go out myself, all that sort of thing. I'm just trying to earn money um, to survive, basically. Um, so I hope you understand the price increase and please accept my apologies that I've had to put my prices up. Um, I didn't do it lightly. Um, and I really value you, you all. And I'm really grateful for all my clients and customers. I've got 61 clients now, which is amazing. And it is growing and I'm doing really well. But like I say, I only work four hours a day if the weather allows. Uh, and of course, winter's harder months. Um, and I've got three children um, with appointments and you know they might get ill and so on. So um, I've just got to be sensible and, and, and try and find ways to you know make a living really so that's me all right thank you bye